Montpellier's crowning glory came on their last visit to the Stade de l'Abbé des Champs. It was a very different feeling 11 years on. Back in 2012, Le Bayet shocked Paris Saint-Germain, beating them to the Ligue 1 Uber Eats title, the only one in Montpellier's trophy cabinet. This time under Romain Pito, the club looking to make sure they stay in the top flight. They started the day two points above the bottom four, and four from Christophe Pellissier's Aja, 19th in the standings, yet a width of the post from taking the lead, and a teenager's first goal. Suleiman Touré on loan from OM, a 19-year-old with a fine header, the follow-up from Keitan Perran, gobbled up by returning Montpellier player in goals, Benjamin Leconte. Three and a half years after leaving for Monaco, but Leconte is back. Bay Niang frustrated, fine save. Again, the woodwork helping out. Well, Ozer were unlucky, Montpellier misfiring. Oh no, not down high and wide. Missing Eli Wai and Wabi Kazri through suspension, missing some direction. Montpellier had lost 65% of their games at Ozer in the top flight. They were having some luck here, Niang over the bar, still stuck on three goals. Good thing for the visitors, they've not won away when conceding first since January 2020. Montpellier happy to be level, Ozer not getting the goals their effort may have deserved. Without a home win since the end of October, they would have hoped for better from Nuno da Costa when he was brilliantly released. An excellent ball, didn't get his bearings right. Miss at one end, Fury at the other. The Cape Verde forward down, but Steffi Mavetidi wasn't hanging around. The Englishman taking full advantage. Not strong enough from da Costa. Referee's whistle remains silent, and a blustering strike from the second best scorer from England in the French top division. The first goal of a difficult season, December 2021, the last time he scored on the road. Well, one came, and like buses, a second soon after. Khalil Fayad releasing Mavadidi, and he was at the double. Bemo Costil electing to join Lille. Andre Radu in for his debut. The Romanian beaten twice. There was some late drama though. Falai Sako penalised for a handball after coming off the bench. Irama Toure, whose penalty put Aja back in the big time, failed to pass the unbeatable Lacombe. What a second debut for the 31 year old, as much the match winner as Steffi Mavadidi.